So welcome to the NZCCM. So this is where you can see through these windows, you can see what the vet department gets up to day to day because this is where we work. And there's also a lot of other information which um, explains what it is to be a zoo vet at Auckland Zoo. And then we can go behind the scenes. We've got, um, this is our normal quarantine ward, the other side of this wall. And then we've got a, another ward here for our sick patients. So one of the animals in here is Kazari, who's our 18 month old red panda who's recovering from a hip fracture. Um, we think she fell out of the tree overnight, although no one was there to see it, but she was certainly very lame first thing in the morning. She's probably about two weeks since the last operation, so she's still convalescing, but she's certainly finding her feet. So this is the main treatment room here at the NZCCM. This is where most of our day-to-day -day work happens and where a lot of our minor procedures happen. But also, if there's a tiger or an orangutan anaesthetised, this is where they come and have the work done. We do have an intensive care ward in here. So this has got lots of vivariums and bird cages in it with our six smaller patients, including the musk lorikeet. She unfortunately fractured her foot, so trying to design a splint and a bandage for a 71 gram bird has been quite a challenge, but some of my vet colleagues have managed to do that successfully. So we also care for animals that come from the wild. At the moment we've got a sea turtle in, washed up on one of the beaches up north. We're doing some primary assessment, we're trying to work out why it ended up washed up on a beach, because that's not a normal thing for a sea turtle uh, to do. Most vets react to sick animals, they try and make them better and they send them home. So we do a lot of that, but we also do a lot of proactive, a lot of preventative medicine, trying to stop animals getting sick in the first place. So we here at the vet department do a lot of work with DOC and, and other external partners dealing with field programmes and the conservation of New Zealand native species. So being able as a vet to have that impact on the population of an endangered species, that's why I became a vet, that's why I love working here and that's the great thing about Auckland Zoo.